talent. I'm talented, smart, and capable of success. I have dreams for the future, and I'll climb to reach those goals and dreams every day, no exceptions. Treasure Hunter's Pledge. As an adult and a treasure hunter, I am committed to search for all the talents, skills, and intelligence that exists in all children and youth. I believe all children are capable of success, no exceptions. Students, please refer to your student computer contract that you signed agreeing to follow the rules and expectations with the device that we loaned to you. Please follow these expectations, never eating or drinking around your device, and help us keep these computers in good condition. If you need another copy of your computer contract, please let your homeroom teacher know. Thank you. Just a friendly reminder of our hallway expectations. Stay to the right, keep your hands to yourself, wear your mask appropriately, and no drinking or eating while in the hallway. Voice levels of students K through five should be at a zero, and students in six through eight should be at a level two. Students not following these rules will be written up and receive consequences. Middle school lunch transition. When entering the cafeteria, all students should enter the cafeteria in an organized manner. All students will report directly to their assigned seat. Students will then be caught up by the table area to purchase lunch. Lunch transition exiting the cafeteria. Students will dispose of their trash when the trash cans come around. Students will stay seated until their teacher's name is announced to be dismissed. Students will walk in a quiet and organized fashion to the next class. Afternoon parent pickup. Students, you're only to leave the classroom when your name says active or next on Pick My Kid. Once you walk through the gate, you need to look for your car. Students in grades three through eight can walk back toward the cafeteria to be assisted to their car. This is not a time to socialize and sit with your friends. If your name was announced, your car is here. Hoodies are permitted on campus. However, all hoods must be kept down and off your head while you're on campus. Cell phones, AirPods, and all other electronic devices must be turned off and put away prior to entering the gates in the morning. These devices should be in a secure location and not visible unless a staff member gives you permission to use it for educational purposes. There should be no eating or drinking in the hallway at all times. As most of you are aware, the Board of County Commissioners repealed their countywide mask mandate. However, St. Lucie Public Schools will maintain the current health and safety protocols, including the use of face masks that we've had in place since the start of the school year. It is evident that those health and safety protocols have helped to minimize the spread of COVID-19 in our schools and have contributed greatly to maintaining a healthy learning and work environment for both students and staff. Students who continuously violate this policy will be sent home to complete the school year virtually. Are you looking for your name on the leaderboard? K-5 students, your I-Ready requirements are two past reading lessons and two past math lessons. For our six through eight students, we need to see two or more combos. Good luck, hoping to see all your names on there next week. The final and fourth quarter of the school year is here. Do you know what your grade is? Log into Skyward today to check your grades. The last basketball game at home is this Tuesday, April 13th. Students who are looking to attend the game must go home first and return at 5.30. Students are not permitted to stay after school and wait for the game to start at 5.30. Please note, you must have a ticket and purchase it online to be able to enter through the gates. Thank you.
As a reminder, collared shirts and whiskey t-shirts must be worn. When wearing a hoodie or zip-up, hoods remain down. A collared shirt or Westgate shirt should be on underneath. Ripped jeans, sweatpants, pajama pants, leggings are not part of our dress code. When wearing Crocs, please make sure that you have the straps on. Hats are not allowed inside the building. Teachers, at this time, please check all your students to make sure that they're in dress code. If they're not in dress code, please write up a dress code violation slip and submit it to the Dean's office. All violating students will need to serve a lunch attention the following day. Thank you. Happiness is a choice, not a result. Nothing will make you happy until you choose to be happy. No person will make you happy unless you decide to be happy. Your happiness will not come to you. It can only come from you. You got this.